Hi, I'm Arian King Comer. My Yoruba name is Ashun Ranke, and that means the goddess of nature and love. And I'm here to honor and celebrate this exhibition of Deep Blue with my colleagues that are in the pathway of indigo expression. Indigo is a color that comes from a natural ingredient coming from the leaves of indigo. There are 32 types of indigo in the world. And the amazing part of all of them is that the leaf turns blue. The plant is used to color. It's a historical 3,000 year old uh, hue. And it started off with tattooing. And then when, if you look at in history, most of the uniforms were done with indigo blue. Um, they were initially coming from India. Indigo is used historically um, for its color of blue. There are two ways of looking at it. It's also a spiritual color. If you think of your chakras, it is the, uh, the one that's for the head, the mental, the spiritual, the above, uh, the universe. But the other is that it was used for commercial um, venues like military uniforms. So if you look at history, most uniforms had blue in them and that's, they were looking for a mass area to be able to grow, to grow indigo for those uniforms. But before that, it was actually very spiritual. They did tattoos. If you go into Morocco or uh, the, in the desert parts of Africa, you will see the tattoos. And if you notice, they are dark blue. Um, so that's the beginning of it, and then when it came this way, they were looking for more spaces, more places to grow more indigo because of the wars and needing that for, this, for the uniforms. I'm happy just to see all of these expressions of indigo um, here, and I'm grateful that it came to you all to, to bring this up so that um, we have a chance to speak our voices in our indigo. I'm happy to see this collection and I just hope that many people get to see this and, and, and see where, where our journeys has taken us.